Hello, and welcome to A Word of Hope for Monday of the second week of Easter. Happy Easter once again. Today, in the reading from the Acts of the Apostles, we have the account of Peter and John returning to the people and preaching once again in the name of Jesus Christ. The story is that they had healed the man who was lame from birth, and they were taken into custody by the scribes and the Pharisees and the judges and the rulers, and they were questioned, and they were warned never to speak in the name of that man, Jesus, again. And then they're released, and they go back to the people. And we have Peter preaching so boldly. Nothing could hold him back. Nothing could stop him now. Isn't that incredible? From the Peter that we've known throughout the life of Jesus of Nazareth, nothing could prevent him from preaching in the name of Jesus. He was no longer afraid, no longer timid, no longer shy or cowering or afraid. It was wonderful. He gives us an example of the power of the witness of our faith. That you and I, too, need to be voices that are heard. Voices for Jesus. Voices that point to the depth of our faith in God and the depth of our faith of what God has done for us in Jesus Christ. You and I need to preach. It's not really easy to share our faith in that way. Oh, it's easy to talk about the externals of our faith. It's easy to talk about what kind of churches we like, what kind of priests we like, what kind of liturgy or music that we like, what kind of devotions we prepare, prepare, uh, prefer. Those are all the externals. Those are all superficial. They're fine, but they're superficial. It's harder to talk about our hearts. It's harder to really share from the depths of our hearts our trust in Jesus, our faith in Jesus, as Peter did. Once we are in touch with it, it will change everything, and we need not be afraid to share it with others. I want to ask you to try that today, maybe with your spouse, maybe with a member of your family. Talk about your relationship with Jesus, what it has meant to you, how it empowers you, how it gives you confidence, how it gives you hope. It could be very significant and very important for someone else to hear how deeply you believe. God bless you.